afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Committee and Field, where this afternoon the Hollis and Panthers, with four wins and two losses, host Hopkinton with two wins, two losses, and two ties. Today's starting lineup for Hopkinton. Midfield, sophomore, number two, Ido Tora. Midfield, freshman, number four, Peter D. McKelly. Midfield, sophomore, number six, Owen Schnur. Defender, senior, number seven, Captain Owen D. Nicola. Forward, senior, number eight, Stephen Mafori. Midfield, junior, number 10, Russell DeMarco. Forward, senior, number 11, Devin Kelly. Defender, senior, number 12, John Carson. Defender, sophomore, number 15, Andrew Gong. Midfield, senior, number 6, Captain Tim Fargiano. Goalkeeper, junior, number 22, Patrick Krantz. In his 16th season, Hawkinson is led by Coach Garrett Sawyer. And now, the starting lineup for the Holliston Panthers. Defender, senior, number three, Captain Ty Carding. Midfield, senior, number 10, Captain Evans DeJong. Forward, senior, number eight, Captain Thomas Stoika. Defender, junior, number seven, Ryan Katz. Forward, Sophomore, number 15, Ben Siegel. Defender, sophomore, number 12, Brendan McLeod. Midfield, sophomore, number 6, Owen Burke. Defender, senior, number 5, Nico, Nico Elwani. Forward, freshman, number 24, Ryan Foley. Forward, senior, number 11, Zach Jacobs. And in goal today, senior, 0-0, Thomas Sykes. In his ninth season, the Panthers are led by head coach Jay Dupuis. Today, we have Ian Shaw, who will be singing our national anthem. At this time, we ask you to please rise and remove your caps for the singing of our national anthem. Oh, say can you see by the dawn's early light What so proudly we hailed at the twilight's last gleaming Whose broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight or the ramparts we watched were so gallantly streaming and the rockets red glare the bombs bursting in air give proof through the night that our flag was still there oh say does that star spangled banner yet wave or the land of the free and the home of the Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Holliston High School 
for Hopkinton Hillers, Holliston Panthers Boys Varsity Soccer. Tom Nappy alongside Steve Sweetapple, Chris Boudet on camera. It's Hillers versus the Panthers on HCAT in Holliston as well as HCAM in Hopkinton. Holliston is 4-2-0 and on this season. The Hillers, two wins, two losses, and two ties. The Hillers with six points overall, Holliston with eight. It should be a great matchup between two talented teams here today as I welcome in my broadcast partner, Steve Sweetapple. Steve, a classic TVL battle here. It should be a good one today. Yep, yep. year in and year out, there are always great battles. Uh, recently, Holliston's had the edge. Hopkinton starting a, a young team today. Should be a very entertaining match, Tom. It certainly should, and we'll take a look at the starters just in case you missed them earlier on. For the Hillers, Yasutora Ito, a midfielder, Peter De Michael, a midfielder, Owen Schnur, a midfielder, Owen De Nicola, a forward, Stephen Maffiori, a forward, Russell DeMarco, a midfielder, Devin Kelly, a forward, John Carson on defense, Andrew Ghana, a defender, Tim Fargiano, a midfielder, and in net, it's Pat Krantz for the Hopkinton Hillers. For the Holliston Panthers, it is Ty Cotting on defense, Owen Burke at midfield, Ryan Katz on defense, Thomas Stoika, a defender, Evan Dijon, a midfielder, Zach Jacobs, a forward, Brandon McLeod on defense, Ben Siegel, a forward, Ryan Foley, a forward, and Thomas Sykes, the goalkeeper. And we are underway here from Holliston High School on this beautiful afternoon. Temperatures in the mid-70s for today's game. Certainly can't ask for better weather than this. As Holliston controls off the bat, McLeod up the near side, and a pass over to Siegel. Ben Siegel trying to keep control of it. Getting in front of Siegel there was Andrew gone. Out of play it goes. Hillers will have the entry. So the Hillers in their away white jerseys, orange numbering with the green lettering across the front. Working left to right across your screen. And you got the Holliston Panthers in their home red jerseys with the white numbering and lettering and the white and red trim down the side. As the Panthers working in Hillers territory, gets away from Dijon, but he's able to get the pass over to the far side. And now up the field goes Katz, looking towards that corner, and out of play it goes. Just okay. underway here in the first half. It looks like Hopkinton set up in a 3-4-3 formation. Going to try to control the midfield. Pat Krantz gets rid of it to his left. At the far side we go. Nice move there by Ito. And out of play it goes along the far sideline. It'll be a throw in for the Panthers. Miller's trying to work it upfield. It's stolen away by Dijon. Dijon with the pass up. Cleared away by the Hillers defender, John Carson. There's a boot there over towards the end line and out of play it goes. Hillers will get to clear it away. Good movement from Holliston down the right flank. Cross just went a little long. Pat Krantz will clear it out. Strong boot there into Holliston territory. Now here comes Russell DeMarco working his way up the near side. DeMarco with some nice moves along the sideline. This one's going to go out. Of, no, it's in place still. Now it's out. Hiller's throwing. Yeah, that's right. Good call from the ref. Ball never cro fully crossed the line. Ah, so free kick for Holliston. <laughs> There was a whistle, I think it was on the field behind us, so maybe that was the confusion. Here's Owen Schnur. Now Holliston in possession, working his way upfield. Thomas Stoika. Stoika trying to take it into the danger zone. And it's out of 
play it goes. Hillers will get to clear it up. Good defensive positioning there from Carson. Kept his hips square to the ball, didn't turn. Pat Krantz gives it a boot. And that'll fly out of play. Hiller's throwing. Big game here for both teams, trying to get enough points to reach the postseason. The Hillers, of course, they had a couple of tough games that ended in ties, so they would certainly like to try to get the win here today. Alliston 4-2 and 0 on the season. They returned a lot of players from last year's team, so I'd say probably slightly more experience for Holliston overall. Along the far side, out of play it goes. It'll be a Holliston throw in. Or free kick, rather, from the far sideline. Had her back to midfield. Trying to work his way up is Mafiori. Mafiori able to keep it in Hiller's possession for the moment. Now Holliston rushing up field, trying to catch up to it is Zach Jacobs around the goalie and wide to the right. Well, Krantz came way out there. Yeah, he had no choice. Jacobs was in on him one-on-one. -on -one. He had to come off of his line and hopefully force him to rush the shot, which he did. Krantz will clear it away. Another good boot there. On the far side, hustling to the ball, Ryan Foley. Ended up out of play, Hiller's throwing. Some good footwork there by Owen Burke. Sends it up the near side towards Ben Siegel. That was cleared away by Owen DeNicola. Back into the box it goes. To Nicola's there. Hiller's trying to clear it away with possession to Marco. Schnur with the pass over to the far side. Holliston winning the possession battle in the early minutes of this one. And there's a nice steal there by Schnur. Here comes the Hillers into Holliston territory. He was looking for Tim Fargiano there, a little too far in front of him. There's several minutes into action here at Holliston High School. A good back and forth battle so far. Here comes the Panthers. Getting in front of that one was Danicola. Margiano with the pass down. Good ball distribution there by the Hillers. Mafiori. Now along the near side, DeMarco. DeMarco feeds it to DeNicola. DeNicola with a strong boot, and that's onto the top of the net. Yeah, nice overlapping run from DeNicola. Sykes will clear it away. Give it up to Brendan McLeod to get rid of it. Strong kick up the far side. Out of play it goes. Hiller's throwing. Back into Hiller's territory goes the captain, Ty Cotting. Strong kick there. Out of play along the near side off of Andrew Gunn. Throwing his to Owen Burke. Pass up the near side to Ben Siegel. 
Siegel going to fling it over to the far side towards Foley and a little too much on that pass. Hiller's on the entry. Now Fiore trying to keep possession along the far side. Halston has it. Pass up to Jacobs. Back and forth we go now at midfield. And a whistle here. Handball oh. engineer. There's a boot by Ty Cotting, trying to get it into the box. Header by Burke. Interrupting along the far side is Devin Kelly for the Hillers. Out of play it goes. Hollison throwing. Evan Dijon, pass over. Now Burke. To the near side, to Elwani. Now with some good footwork, Ben Siegel leaves it out. No one there for Holliston. DeMarco with the pass down to Mafiori. Jumping in there to interrupt is Dijon. Mafiori trying to get to it. Here comes Tim Fargiano. Cleared back into Hiller's territory. Well, it seems like Hiller's playing defense for a good portion of this uh, first 10 minutes or so. Yeah, Holliston's had more ball control, but still a sloppy game from both teams. No consistent holding of the ball. And now the Hiller's threatening here over the far side, but just a little bit too far in front of Schnurr. Holliston will clear it upfield. Brendan McLeod, the sophomore, will get rid of it. Header at midfield by Schnurr. Along the far side now, Hiller's trying to maintain control. Here comes Hopkinton, perhaps working on something here. There's Matt, pass over by DeMarco, cleared away by the Holliston defenseman, McLeod. Hiller is on the entry. On the throw in, it is Andrew Gone. About 12 minutes into action. Nice. Better there, and it's wrapped up. Nice flick on from Owen Schnurr. Certainly was. Sykes was there to wrap it up for Holliston and he'll chuck it to the near side. Here comes Burke. Having some trouble getting around a number of hillers in the area. And it was a good job by Fergiano getting in front of Burke. Pass back over to Jean. On the far side now. Hiller is trying to threaten once again. Schnurr. And Schnurr trying to figure out where to go with it. He's going to go towards the Nicola. And over to the goaltender Sykes it goes. He'll wrap it up. Strong drop kick there, and a header out of bounds by Andrew Gunn. Thrown by Ben Siegel. Along the near side is Stoika. Now Dijon. Pass to the far side, put out of bounds off of a hiller. Ryan Katz was trying to work it upfield.
Allison will have the entry from the far sideline. End of the game for the Panthers is Ben Cagno, a junior. Good footwork there along the far side. Out of play. This will be a Hillers throw in. Another throw in. And on the entry, it'll be Andrew Gone. It's a free kick, rather. Strong boot there. And jumping up and wrapping it up is Thomas Sykes. Strong boot nonetheless from gone. Yeah, it was a well-placed ball. Nobody from Hopkinton in moving in front of the goalie. He had clear view of the ball, an easy save. Schneer was trying to get there, but could not cut off Sykes. Now with possession, it is Stoika. Pass back to Burke. Now here's Dijon. Jumping in front of him was DeMike Kelly. Offsides, Off Hollistons. Just over 15 minutes into action here in the first half. Scoreless between the Hopkinton Aylers and the Holliston Panthers. Tom Nappy, Steve Sweetapple on the call, Andrew Bidet on camera. An H-Cat, H-Cam combination for today's game. On the far side, out of play it goes. Throw in for Holliston. Cats on the entry. Back out of play. This time off of Holliston. Miller's trying to work it into Holliston territory. Jumping in front now, Dijon. Pass over. Towards the near side, and a strong boot up by McLeod. Pass over by Stoika. Now it's Cagno. Getting in front of him was Danicola. Cagno able to maintain, however. Stoika rushing in, looking for a shot. Oh. And it, oh, a great setup by Stoika. Ben Siegel was right there, but could not get a shot on it. Rolled right by him. And now here comes. The Hillers upfield fast and furious. Schnur trying to get in there. Pass over to DeNicola. We get a whistle here. And it's in favor of the Hillers. They'll have the free kick. Nicola will take it. He has a strong leg. Don't be surprised if he tries to put it right in the net here. Here's a header and jumping up and ripping it down is Thomas Sykes, the junior goalkeeper. Another flick on from Schnur. Good target, man. Sykes places it nicely towards Cagno. Pass up by Elwani. Krantz will wrap this one up. Hillers led by head coach Garrett Sawyer in his 16th season as the Hillers head coach. Alston led by Jay Dupuy He's in his ninth season. And this one's in front. Sykes able to get there. And he was just able to cut off Mafiori. Better by Gaunt. Hillers able to take it away. Along the far side now. It's 
Surprised that little pushed in draw a whistle, but yeah, I'm too. Is it up? They let him play out there, no doubt. <laughs> Whew. That was cleared off of uh, De Nicola there. Owen Burke able to stay with it. Pass over to Elwani. Elwani feeds it to his right to Siegel. Now it's Dijon. Along the far side, that's Katz. Pass over. And it's cleared away by Gone. Panthers trying to work their way up once again. There's a shot, and it is blocked. Loose ball. Krantz slides out, covers it up. And that was a good shot by Ben Siegel. Yeah, Holliston, <clears throat> last 10 minutes, Tom, having much better possession of the ball here. Ito clears it upfield. Along the far side. Race to get to it, but out of play it goes. Off of Hopkinton. Yeah, I'd like to see the Hillers switch the field here and get the ball on the right side. DeMarco's had tons of open space. He seems to be able to get by his defender. Cats on the entry. Nice clear up field by the right side defenseman. Strong boot there over to the far side to Donahue. Nobody's nobody's coming late for Holliston. And yeah, Dijon sent that over to Donahue, but no one was in the middle. Or it was Jacobs rather sending it to him. On the far side, there's Ito. Over to Schnur. Now De Nicola. Over to Rudder. Rudder's trying to get it back to Fargiano. Ito along the near side, but Donahue able to get to it. Pass over to Stoika. Stoika sends it flying. A little too much on that one towards Ryan Foley. Yeah, Holliston's content to play a long ball here to try to get it uh, over Hopkinton's back line. The problem is they don't have any midfielders following up. So even if they do get the ball to the forward, Hopkinton's got six guys back, and there's only three red shirts around. So as long as it's not a breakaway, Hopkinton should be fine there. Yeah, we'll see if that... There's a transition they will make. Off of Ito, pass up. Out along the far side it goes once again. Free kick here for the Hillers. Miss Tora Ito will take it. Strong kick there, right into the box. And foul on Schnur. Pushed him in the back. Seventeen forty and counting left to go in the first half. Good back and forth battle here between Alston and Hopkinton. Game remains scoreless. Some good shots on net by both sides. Long clear up the far side. And a play goes off the Hillers. Throw in Hopkinton. Hillers trying to work it upfield. With possession, it's DeMarco. Leaves it behind to De Nicola. 
Nicola staying with it for the moment. Now Holliston able to get to it. He was challenged by Dijon there. And a play along the near side, throwing Hillers. De Nicola will take it. To Fargiano he goes. Fargiano trying to maneuver around a couple Panthers. He's tripped up. And a play goes. Halston on the entry, Nico Alwani, a senior. Marrero with the pass back to Burke. Racing along the far side, Farrell. He's cut off by Katz for Holliston. Sends it up towards Jacobs. Here comes Holliston. Zach Jacobs with possession. Maybe a shot opportunity. Centers it up, but no one there once again. And once again, no midfield follow-up from the Panthers. It's actually, they're bailing Hopkinton out. Rara to Burke. Surprised he didn't just take that shot. Katz sends it up the far side. Some good footwork there and a strong boot. Wide left goes Ben Siegel. Panthers keeping the pressure on the Hillers here. 15 minutes left in the first half. They certainly are. Grants will get rid of it. Just past Schnur. On the far side, Schnur. Sends it up to DeMarco. Now here comes Holliston. Stoika. Pass over to the near side of Marrera, and Marrera will take a hack at it, but send it over the net. Well, Marrera couldn't get much of a foot under it there as it was coming at him quick. Krantz will get rid of it. Marco with the pass over to the near side of De Nicola. Now it's stolen away by Holliston. Here comes Stoika. Stoika with some good footwork, a shot and a save by Krantz. Good squeeze of the ball from Krantz. Stoika had Andrew Gunn burned and was able to get a nice shot off, but Krantz was ready for it. Strong boot there after the fact by Krantz, but Halston right back into Hopkinton territory. Back to Krantz, and he's just able to get rid of it before Stoika comes rushing in. Out of play it goes. Throw in Holliston. Ryan Katz will take it. Off of Zach Jacobs, and out of play. Miller's on the entry. On the far side, DeMarco. He's chipped up a little bit and glad the official didn't see that push. Free kick here for, excuse me, a free kick here for Hopkins. <laughs> or is it, a, is it gonna set it up? The 42 yard line on the far side. And we'll send it right down to Aito. Good pass over. The Panthers loaded the box with defenders. And it looks like we'll have another free kick here for Hopkinson. 
And this will be a nice position for the Hillers. Yeah, this is danger zone. I'm going to talk it out here and try to game plan. Yep, you're 20 yards out, a little bit of an angle. Keeper's got uh, a large wall set up with five, five defenders. So what do you think they're going to do here? Go straight for the net? You no, know, they should be, they should go upper right hand upper keeper's upper left hand corner. The wind's blowing. The wall set up for the right side. Simon oh. Rudder is going to fake it. Look at this. Nice. Oh! Shot. Wow! Yeah. Great take. Upper left hand corner, right where he should have put it. Goal Hillers Owen Schnur. Well struck ball from Schnur. 10.52 left to go in the first half. one nothing Hillers. That was impressive, Steve. Yep. Yep. Put it right where he should have. Upper left-hand corner. Some good trickery there by the Hillers. And then the finisher. Hit it with pace and hit it with enough dip. Well-struck ball. Hopkinton goal, number six, Owen Schnur. Schnur had a perfect kick on that one. Well, on the far side go the Panthers. Zach Jacobs is trying to set it up. Well, I guess that little strategy talk prior to that free kick worked well. Krantz will get rid of it. Zooms it up the far side. Here comes Holliston, Stoika. He'll take a shot and Krantz wraps it up. Another good save from Krantz. Well positioned right at the top of the six yard box. Krantz has been busy in this first half. Yes, he has. Over to Gone. Pass down by Shaw. Here comes the Hillers trying to threaten once again. Yeah, Rudder's calling for the ball. He had he was all alone. To Nicola gets it along the far side to that was to Mike Kelly. That'll play it goes. Throw in Hillers. And then kick down a bounds off of a Panther. D. Mike Kelly will do it again. <laughs> right off the official. <laughs> All this to throw in. Better not throw it too hard off the official. I might give Hollis a penalty kick. Both teams having a little trouble keeping the ball in play here on this last series. Panthers on the entry. And yeah, foul on Hillers. Yeah, free kick Holliston. 8.15 and counting, left to go in the first half. Hiller's up one to nothing on Holliston. Very impressive goal by Owen Schnur on about a 22 yard free kick. Strong boot there. Good header out of the box. There's Andrew Gunn getting in there. Panthers still in the danger zone for the Hillers. Here comes Hopkinson clearing it out. Getting in there was shot. Ooh. We got a trip there. That uh, was a push. I'm surprised there's not a card given here. Yeah, maybe a little warning. Yeah, Coach Sawyer's just getting a little talking too. So it was against the Hillers. Yeah, Shaw with a push. Ah. 
Well, the official coming out. I'm going to see a card here. Nope. Good free kick for Holliston. Well defended by the Hillers. Right back into the box off of Elwani, and then a header out. On the far side, Dijon. A couple Hillers in front of him. Can he get around him? Nope. Deflected out of bounds by Carson. Throw in Panthers. On the entry, right into the box. Cleared away for the moment. Nicely done there by the Hillers. I was able to get in there and clear it out. Hillers trying to work the far side. And a play it goes. It was off of a Panther. Sean the throw in and back out of play it goes. This time off of a Hiller. And off of Komkowicz. Sean with the pass through a couple Panthers. Now over to the near side. Nice move there by DeNicola. Yep, great step forward. Good leave. DeNicola and Komkowicz working. With each other, trying to set up a shot, but well defended by the Panthers. Kalkowicz able to get in there, but it's cleared away by McLeod. Yeah, Holliston's got time to do a buildup from the back, but they're just booting the ball. It's almost a little panicky. Approaching five minutes left to go in the first half. Remains one nothing Hillers. D. Kelly on the throw-in. Back out this time off the Hillers. And a play. Halston will throw it in. Up the far side towards Zach Jacobs he goes. Jacobs trying to set it up in the box, but cleared out by Carson out of play. Yep, good control from Carson. Once again, Hopkinton, though, had six defenders back, six white shirts, and there were only two red shirts in Hopkinton's box. So Hollison's just not following the, the play. Cleared away by the Hillers. Awani, pass up, no one there except a couple of Hillers. Here comes Hopkinson, pass down by Schnur. Now rushing to it is Maffiori. Maffiori trying to work the far side. Stepping in there to take it away was Burke. Cleared up field by McLeod. Now midfield we go as Fargiano able to get it over towards Shaw. Now Di McKelly. Have a whistle here. And an offsides call. No, foul on Holliston. Oh. Free kick, Hillers. Fergiano will take it. Or will he? Strong boot there, right into the box, and jumping up, ripping it down is Sykes. That was a good kick there by T. Kelly. Shot. Pass up the far side. Just trying to work it over. Argiano. To De Nicola. Now Shaw. 
Halston has it as Jacobs able to get there. Stoika trying to leave it for Jacobs. John trying to get to it, got tied up with Schnur. Yeah, Owen did a great job of shielding the ball with his body and forced Holliston to come through him, which resulted in the foul. Now it's stolen away from DeNicola by DeJean. Pass over to the near side of Stoika. Stoika has good footwork, looking for a shot here. Can't get to it. Pass over to the near side now to Stoika. And put out a play off of DeNicola. Less than two minutes left to go in the first half. In the final moments here of frame number one. Throwing by Stoika right in front of the net. Good header out. And now here comes Maffiori rushing up the field. The header to keep it out of the box was by Gone. Pass over to Maffiori. He'll get a little shot off it, but could not get what he wanted there. It was a good feed from Schnur. Sent in to Hiller's defensive zone. And quickly. Yeah, would have liked to have seen some communication there between Gone and. That's going to draw the whistle. Yeah. That might draw a card. That was a pretty significant push there, but we're going to play on, it looks like. Pass over to Matt Fiore. He couldn't get there in time. I'm surprised we didn't get a stoppage there, Steve. Yep. Well, they're really letting him play out there, that's for sure. These two teams typically always do have a tough physical game. I must admit, it makes it a lot of fun. It does. After the first half, it's the Hopkinton Hillers 1, the Holliston Panthers 0. What a game we have here at Holliston High School. The Hillers leading at the half, one to nothing. second half. Coming up next, it's boys varsity soccer on either HCAT in Holliston or HCAM in Hopkinton. Have you ever considered texting and driving? If so, you should know the consequences. If caught texting and driving for the first time, you could get an $100 fine plus your license taken away for 60 days. The consequences only get worse the more you get caught. Even if you don't get caught, there could be serious effects. You could get into a car accident and hurt yourself or someone else. Texting and driving is a very dangerous combination, so stop before this happens to you. Welcome back to Holliston High School. We are ready for the second half. A 1-0 Hillers lead as we start the second frame. And Hopkinton will start off with possession. Hillers in their white away jerseys. Working right to left across your screen. Holliston in their at-home red jerseys. And that's out of play along the near side. The only goal of the game, a 22-yard Free kick by Owen Schnur after a little trickery by the Hillers. Throwing Ryan Katz for Holliston. Header by D. Mike Kelly. Goes out of play and a free kick rather by D. Mike Kelly over to Ido. On the far side, DeMarco. He's trying to get it up towards De Nicola, but a little too much on that one. <laughs> Tom Nappy alongside Steve Sweetapple, Chris Boudet on camera. Hopkinton Hillers, Holliston Panthers, Boys Varsity Soccer on either HCAM and Hopkinton or HCAT and Holliston. Cleared away by Brendan McLeod. On the far side, that's Siegel. Here comes the Hillers trying to work their way up. It was a nice steal there by Fargiano. Over to Stoika. Stoika has some good footwork and he's been able to get a couple shots off in this game. Here 
comes Elwani. Out of play. It'll be a Holliston entry. Stoika will throw it in. Into the box. Cleared away. I believe that was Fargiano who got in there and cleared it out. Now wrapped up by Krantz. Just underway here in the second half. The scoreboard uh, shut down, so we'll try to keep you updated with how much time is left the best we can. There's a little push there. Allison will get to clear it away. Well, these officials let them play out there. Yeah, they are. As long as you're consistent, that's fine. They certainly have been. Yep. Header by Jacobs. Back and forth we go with the headers. Jacobs and Carson and Fergiano. Now here comes the Hillers. And jumping in there to take it away is Katz for Holliston. Over to Stoika. Over to the near side, Adam Herrera. Herrera tripped up, and the Hillers have it. Schnur trying to work around a couple Panthers. Stealing away, Stoika. One of the captains on the Holliston Panthers in his senior year. On the far side now, out of play. It'll be an entry for Holliston. Now, this is how to play off a Panther. Throw in Hillers. Do it again, this time from about the 40 yard line. Now Fiore, pass back. Pass over by DeMarco. Over to DeMichele. Sends it up. Cleared back down by the Panthers. Siegel. Right toe. Gets in there, and now here's Shaw. Kelly. It's good footwork there by Dijon. Now Jacobs. Sends it to Stoika. Stoika surrounded by Hillers. Good D. It certainly was. It was a steal there by Devin Kelly. Now it's cleared away by Krantz. Offsides. Hillers offsides. Holliston will send this one flying. Strong boot there by McLeod. That'll force Krantz out. He'll wrap it up. Some good hang time on that one from Krantz. Yeah, but once again, there's only one white shirt around the ball. Four red shirts, one white shirt. Fargiano was looking for Schnur, but jumping in there was Dijon. Now Stoika sends it up towards Jacobs. And Jacobs couldn't get the shot off. And he's jumping in there was Carson to get in front of him. Yep, good recovery from John. Stayed with him stride for stride. Didn't give him an option. Krantz will get rid of it. Goes far side with it. Gone sends it upfield. Here comes the Hillers. 
Good pass up and now closing in. Nice save from the keeper. It certainly was. That shot was by Mafiori. It was a good pass up by DeMarco. Sykes able to deflect it away and now here comes Dijon. Pass to Stoika. Sends it towards Burke. Out in front. And sending it flying with Siegel. Nice build up from the back there from the Panthers. Krantz will get rid of it. Right to midfield he goes. Here is Stoika. Far side over to Siegel, now back towards Stoika. Stoika on the far side with gone. No one's moving for him to give him an option though. Now to Marco. Up to Mafiori. To Marco. Getting a foot in there was Fergiano. Cleared away by Ty Cotting. Marrera. And this will be a free kick for Holliston. Stoika will take it. Ball set up at about the 25 yard line. Will he try to go to the net with this? It looks like Dijon is gonna get in there too. A little confusion. Pass to Dijon. Shot. Good save. And it's deflected away by Krantz. Great diving save by Krantz. Well executed play from the Panthers. It certainly was. Trying a little trickery of their own after the Hillers got a goal in the first half off a free kick. Here's Stoika on the corner. Header, and goal. Cotting with a goal. Ty Cotting makes it one to one. The senior captain coming through. Yeah, he did a delayed run into the box. Nobody ran with him. He went in all alone on the goaltender. One to one. What a game we got here. I don't know how much time is left. Scoreboard's off, but I think we're about 10 minutes into the second half. Well, Alston's been certainly putting a whole lot of pressure on the Hillers. In the last few minutes of the first half and into the second half, and it pays off. Aito leaves it behind for Fergiano, and out of the near side, Shaw. Shaw works around the defender, trying to set up Mafiori, and it's deflected away. Burke gets rid of it. Over towards Stoika. A little too far. Yeah, a little too far there. Krantz will wrap it up. Here's Aito. Pass up the far side. Jumping in there and stealing it away was Dijon. To Mike Kelly. Katz turns it around. Off of Stoika. John tripped up, but he's able to regain his footing and now gets it out in front of Stoika. Stoika rushing in, trying to slow it down. And now we'll put the shot on the ground and it's wrapped up by Krantz. Stoika certainly would have liked to get a little more under that. Krantz gets rid of it. 
I think Krantz could definitely be a punter. Yeah, he's <laughs> the uh, the problem is he's out kicking his coverage. To Mike Kelly. What you'd like to see is Hopkinton actually pushing forward as soon as Krantz is starting his run up, just have somebody go. In the box here, and it's wrapped up by Sykes. Along the far side, keeping it in play for the moment, gone. Now put out off of Holliston. On the throw in for the Hillers, Owen to Nicola. Out off of DeMarco. Pass up by Ito. Now Fergiano sends it over to Shaw. Fiori, Shaw trying to race in there. Getting in front of that one was Marrera. And we have a whistle here. In favor of the Hillers. And what, what it was is the ball was actually out of play before that pass by Marrera. It's throwing Hopkinton. Mike Kelly will take it. Off of Fargiano, out of bounds. Ryan Katz on the entry. Sends it to Marrera. Shot. Too many Panthers in the area. And now it's stolen away. Here comes Ido. Ido firing out of nowhere. Pass up to Kelly. Kelly trying to send it forward. No one there for the Hillers. Well, Kelly sacrificed his body there as Ryan Katz closed in. Well, the clock is back up, saying 26.54 and counting. Left to go in the second half. So we'll take their word for it. Panthers trying to threaten along the far side. Siegel. And nice Siegel. step, Owen. Yeah, a great steal there by <clears throat> DeNicola. Jumping in front of that one was DeMarco, and he'll send it up. Clearing it away, Katz. Up the near side of Marrera. Now here's another good steal by DeMarco. Russell DeMarco rushing up the near side. And he was slightly tripped up. Ball, I believe, was out of play in front of Ryan Katz. Hiller's throwing. Andrew gone on the entry. Sends it over to Fargiano. And now out off the Hillers. Brendan McLeod will get rid of it. Air is it out. Sent right back in the territory by Ido. Fargiano. Ido. Back to Fargiano. Now to the near side to Kelly. Kelly tripped up a little bit, able to stay with it. Back to Ido. Fargiano. Ido. Nice, nice layoff from Ido. DeMarco. Just trying to zoom it into the box there. Along the far side, Ryan Foley trying to track it down for Holliston. And could not get there in time. <laughs> Sent out a play off of a Panther. Hiller's throw in. 
Ido takes it. Pass back over towards Carson. And he'll send it over to Krantz. Now to Shaw. Along the near side. Deflected out of play off of Marrera. To McKelly on the entry. Out in front here comes Stoika. Good footwork there, Stoika. Nice step over from Schnur. Schnur contesting Stoika and ended up winning that battle. It was called out off the hiller, so it's a corner here. But Schnur certainly might have saved a goal there. Corner from the near side. Taken by Stoika. Header. Out of play. Pretty good setup by Stoika. The header out of play off of McLeod. Twenty-three minutes and counting left to go in the second half. A one one ball game between the Hillers and Holliston. Fiori with the header. And Halston will clear it away off a Marrera header and a McLeod kick. Good and step from Andrew. Gone able to pass it up to DeMarco. Hiller is working in Holliston territory. Jumping in there is Dijon. Burke. Use it towards the far side. Pass up by Alwani. Now along the sideline, Foley. Sends it towards Stoika. Here goes Stoika trying to work his way around. Hiller's consistently surrounding Stoika. They know how dangerous he is. Yeah, he's not getting any help, though, from anybody. His teammates are actually standing around watching him. I know he's impressive, but you gotta help him. You gotta you gotta <laughs> move. Owen Burke. Sends it over towards Cagno. Oof. Collision between Cagno and De Nicola. That draws a whistle. Free kick for Holliston. It's going to be McLeod to take it. Not what Holliston wanted to do there. Mafiori. Over to Vergiano. Trying to send it back to Mafiori. Jumping in there. Steal it away is Burke. Good, good look. Stoika with an open lane. Nicely defended by the Hillers. Still in the danger zone, however. Pass back over to Marrera. And now it's stolen away, Schnur. Working his way upfield. That is DeMarco. Fiore trying to track it down. Still in play. Amazingly, that didn't go out of play, but now it will. Rowan Holliston. About halfway through the second frame. Hillers with the lone goal in the first half. Holliston with the lone goal here in the second half so far. Whistle here. I think the officials wanted the uh, Panthers to wait for a couple substitutions to come in before the throw in. No, they wanted them to move it back. 
Ah. So they will indeed move it back. Nice kick there by De Nicola. Now working his way up to Marco. Heading in front of him was Dijon. And DeMarco nice. steals it back. Nice, nice play there from Burke. Dijon up the near side. Here's DeMichele stepping in. And we'll get a trip here and a whistle. Free kick coming for the Hillers. Official going to check on DeMichele. We'll have Krantz take it. Nice kick there. Into the box, cleared out. Nice step from gone. Well, maybe the Patriots should call up Krantz would be their uh, field goal kicker. Ball on the far side. Here comes Halston threatening. Nicely done there by the Hillers defenseman, John Carson. He yeah, would have liked to have seen Jacobs one time that. By touching the ball. And going to look for a second touch, he gave Carson time to get there. Yeah, that was a missed opportunity there. Throw in Hillers. Wind starting to pick up a little bit here at Committee and Field in Holliston. Krantz gets rid of it. Big drop kick there, but a little bit too much for any Hillers to get there, or is it? Let's see. Sure, trying to get to it, out of play. Tom Nappy, Steve Sweetapple, happy to bring you Hopkinton Hillers, Halston Panthers soccer. Chris Boudet on camera. On either H. Cam in Hopkinton or H. Cat in Halston. A one to one game here in the second half. Closing in on 16 and a half left to go in the second frame. Along the near side, Ryan Katz. Cleared back up by Carson and out of play it goes, throwing Halston. Cats on the entry. Nice kick there by Ido. And somehow able to stay with it was DeMarco, but we'll have a whistle. Looks like we're getting some kind of warning here for Evan Dijon. What do you think that was about, Steve? Yeah, they say it was a push from behind. I thought it was a actually a fair 50-50 ball. Yeah, I guess a bit of a surprising call there, considering not much has been called today. Along the far side. Trying to work his way upfield to Nicola, but stolen away. Too many Panthers in the area, now they're threatening. Mm -hmm. Carson trying to get there. It's a Carson nice step from Carson. Yeah. Now Stoika. And it is out of play. It's going to be a corner for Halston. Hopkins has got a Mark Cotting coming in. He's walking up from midfield. Stoika will take it. Ty Cotting will draw. Join the fun in the box. He had the earlier Holliston goal. He got yeah. it again. Oh, no, it's a save. He Almost had it. Cotting got, got his head on the ball. Krantz is shooken up. There was some contact there, I think, between Cotting and Krantz. Krantz tried to cut him off and just some simultaneous contact. And he's a little shooken up. He's going to shake it off and stay in the game, I believe. 
And he'll roll it to his right. Well, the same strategy on that corner almost worked again for Holliston. But it was nicely done there by Krantz. Krantz will clear it up. Fargiano. To Mike Kelly. And Fiore. Fiore and Schnur trying to work their way up. Good footwork here by Barrera. Barrera now. Jacobs getting in there up against De Michele. And now here's Ido. Fargiano with the pass up. And now with the feed to Marco looking for Mafiori. Tied up along the near side and boxed out by Katz. But out of play it goes, throwing Hillers. Good defensive play from Katz. On the entry for Hopkinton, Andrew gone. He'll go fling it right into the box. No one there. And now we have a one-on-one -on -one between Stoika and Carson briefly, but Carson will defer that. Throw in over towards Carson. No one there for Holliston as Jacobs was able to knock it into the box. Krantz clears it away. A great send off there by Krantz towards Schnur, but too many Panthers in the area. Out of play. Oof. Hopkins can get away with an illegal throw there. Holliston will have a free kick. Time winding down in the second half. Approaching 12 minutes left to go. And there has not been a whole lot of stoppage time. The cloud. Nicely defended by the Hillers, Mafiori. Back towards D. Mike Kelly. Aito. Up to Mafiori. And now it is DeMarco. DeMarco trying to work his way up. There to bail him out, D. Mike Kelly. Fargiano sends it over the far side to DiNicolo, sends it back to DiMichele. Mafiori now. Good footwork there by DeMarco to keep it in play. And here comes DeMarco into the box. And it's cleared away. Boot down by Burke. Dijon sends it up the near side to Jacobs. Jacobs able to send it to Stoika. Now sends it back. Trying to rush in there was Burke. How long Good step from Owen. Yeah, it certainly was. To Nicola. Able to grab possession and send it upfield. Over to Mafiori, along the near side, out of play. It seems like Holliston may be doing a little bit better of a job at sending backups downfield when they get into the offensive zone. Yeah, Panthers are still playing a more of a defensive-minded game. They're just, they're not giving their forwards any any help once they get uh, past midfield. Then they've had the better scoring chances and they should have probably three or four goals if they actually had their midfield following the forwards. T. McKelly on the throw in. Goes to Fargiano with it. Put out a play off of Katz. Throw in Hillers. Andrew Gunn will take it. Blow 10 minutes left to go in the second half, a 1-1 game. Header out of the box. And we'll get the header on, it was McLeod. 
We'll have a free kick for Holliston. Cloud sends it flying. Ryan Foley getting a boot on it. Try to keep possession. Cats, or the Stoika rather, sends it to Foley. And a shot there wide left. Nice strike. No one crashing the net. Krantz will clear it away. Pretty good turnout for today's game. A lot of Hillers fans making the trip here over to Holliston. And of course, the Holliston faithful showing up as well. And pushing the back. That was Ryan Foley from the Panthers. Krantz will get rid of it. From the 34-yard line. Header out of bounds off of Holliston's Ryan Foley. <clears throat> to Mike Kelly, over to DeMarco. Margiano trying to get in there, but too many Panthers in the area, able to get in front of Vassington, who just recently hopped into the game. Now sent back to Krantz to get rid of it. Nice pass up to Carson. Panthers threatening. Here comes Stoika. Good footwork there. Trying to center it up. Can anyone get there for Holliston? Yep. There's a shot and a goal. It's Ben Siegel. 2-1 Panthers. Assist Stoika. That's what they, they've needed to do all game is just have a midfielder following the run of play. They did it and... Yeah, they get their goal. Number 15, Ben Siegel. Well, Steve, you've been talking about it, and finally they pretty much did what you've been saying all game long, and it paid off. Two to one, Panthers. Pressure is now on the Hillers. McKelly over to Rudder. Right out, sends it up out in front to DeMarco. DeMarco, some good footwork there. Sent out off of Holliston. Kelly on the entry. Goes into Ido. There's uh, Fargiano. Kelly trying to send it over to the box. Holliston quick to clear it away. Stoika sends it out in front. Carson able to get there. That's it. Smart play from Carson. Just settle it down. And Jacobs quickly approaching. Send it back to Krantz and clear it out. Yeah, you actually prefer Krantz to pass that to a defender. Work the ball up because all he did was turn it over to Holliston. He'll air this one out. Rushing in, Simon Rudder, cleared away by Katz. Out of play along the near side. Throw in Hillers. About six minutes left to go in regulation. A two to one Holliston lead. Fargiano leaves it behind for Kamkowicz. Sent up by Schneer. Got a play along the near side. Throwing D. Mike Kelly. Also trying to threaten once again. It's a foot raise. Carson trying to get there. And boots it out of bounds as Jacobs was right on his heels. Yeah. 
Throw in Holliston. Stoika will take it. End of the box. Clear it out. Nicely done along the far side by Kelly. Surrounded now by Panthers. Stolen away. Back and forth we go along the far sideline. Pass back by Dijon. Sent in Hiller's territory by Ty Cotting, and Krantz will wrap that one up. In the final five minutes, if the Hillers want at least a point, they need a goal. Holliston up two to one. Near side, Rudder. He's trying to get that one over to Schnurr. Put out a play along the far sideline. Panthers on the entry. Sun peeking back out to pretty much its full extent. Can create a difficult situation on those throw-ins at times. Boy, Stoika's just got great control of the ball. You, there were three Hopkinton defenders within a yard of him, and they couldn't take the ball away from him. Man, he's really been a big threat for Hollis and working the ball into the attack zone. To Mike Kelly to Carson. Here comes Holliston again. Stoika was offside there. Holliston had him on a break, but just too many touches on the ball. Well, Hiller's go going to have to be a bit quick about getting this one upfield. Over to the near side, to Mike Kelly. Trying to get there. Rudder had brief contact with it, put out a play. Off of Foley, Rudder on the entry. Right into D. Mike Kelly, Ido, Fargiano, trying to turn it around. Working his way forward, and he's cut off. Briefly getting in there was DeMarco. And all of a sudden, <laughs> cleared away. Went right off of D. Mike Kelly and out of bounds. Yeah, all Holliston's trying to do here is just boot the ball up to Jacobs and Stoika. Cats on the entry to McLeod. And that kick did not go as planned. Kelly on the entry. Sent up by Carson, Stoika sends it down. Now it's a foot race, Jacob's trying to get there. He's just gonna bring it into the corner. Jacob's up against just Carson. stand it up. Yep. Trying to send it over to Stoika. Nice cover from Ito. Throw in for Holliston. On the entry, Stoika taking his time with it a little bit for obvious reasons. Put out a play. And we'll have a corner here. I don't understand that call. Jacobs was, the ball went off him. You thought it was out on Holliston. Yeah. yeah. I don't normally do this. When Rudder, I, when Rudder came through, he kicked the ball and then it hit the bottom of Jacob's foot. Well, um, it's not going to matter. The Holliston Panthers are going to win it, two to one. But for the record, I thought it was out on Hopkinson. We'll have to review <laughs> the tape on that one. Holliston scores two second half goals, and the Hillers able to get the lone goal in the first half, but. Holliston improving to five and two. The Hillers fall to two, three and two, two to one 
win for the Panthers. It was a good game out there today, Steve. It was. It was a very good game. The um, Holliston did outplay Hopkinton. Uh, you know, as a Hopkinton fan, I hate to say it, but Holliston did deserve the win. They outplayed them. Uh, it, it, they had the better scoring chances. Hopkinton's one goal from Schnur was just a fantastic free kick. But, um, you know, well fought, well played game. It certainly was. Well, the Hillers will look to turn it around when they meet up with Medway this coming Thursday. And the Halston Panthers, they're happy to grab their fifth win of the season. Now up to 10 points overall as the Holliston Panthers take down the Hopkinton Hillers by a final score of 2-1. to one. For Chris Boudet on camera, my broadcast partner Steve Sweetapple. I'm Tom Nappy. The final score for the final time. The Halston Panthers over the Hopkinton Hillers 2-1. This has been Boyd's Varsity Soccer on either HCAM and Hopkinton or HCAT and Holliston. Thanks for watching. Take care. Enjoy the rest of your day. We'll talk to you again soon.